So today on the Virtual Pub Project, we're going to start a two-part episode on that fantastic pub game, Darts. So, like I said, this subject is going to be split into two videos. So, video one, which is this video, is going to focus on Darts the game, how it's played, and the rules and regulations. And then video two, which I'll post probably tomorrow, will go into the history of Darts, etc, etc, etc. So, if you're not interested in how to play Darts, and... Uh, the rules of darts, skip on to that video. So, how do you play the game darts? Well, first things first, you need a darts board, much like the one on your screen now. This is our dart board upstairs. Now, for reference, your dart board should be roughly 1.73 metres up off the floor. This is to the centre bullseye, and then you should be at least 2.37 metres. There should be a little raised platform known as an oki. Yes, we do have an Oki at the arcade, it's just we made one that was removable so it didn't become a trip hazard when people weren't playing the dartboard. So, once you've got your Oki and your dartboard and a friend to play with, it's about time you started playing some darts. So, how do you play darts? The game of darts is simple. You start with a score of 501 and you want to get down to zero. Now, depending on where your dart lands on the dartboard, depends on what you score. The white and black chunks you see, they are worth exactly the number that is directly above them. So, the one directly at the top is 20, next to that one, 1, so on. You also have small colour chunks, the green in this example. This is a double scoring point section. You score double whatever the top number is. Just below that, you have the slightly smaller section, green in the example here where the dart is, which is the triple points. So, the one that this is listed in would be a three point scorer. The little green circle on the inside of the board, that's worth 25 points. And then finally, the bullseye, that's a 50.1 there. Here's a better layout that shows you exactly what each individual section is worth, but basically you can work it out from there. Whatever it says on the number, and then double, triple, 25, 50. So, each person takes it in turn to throw three darts gradually decreasing their score as they go. Now, your objective is to get to zero. That is the winning goal, is to get to zero. But you can't just lob a dart anywhere on the board that magically makes it zero. No, they had to put in an extra rule to make it more interesting. So to win, you either need to get a double, which remember is that outer ring, or the bullseye. That's basically it. Pretty simple once you get to know it. And that's that, really. So, uh, that has been the first section of this video, which has been just a basic overview of the rules um, so people know what darts is. Tomorrow we'll be looking more at the history of darts, where the game originated from, how it was formed and obviously its place in the modern day pub. So check back tomorrow to see that and until then, see you soon.